Congratulations on your purchase of the Enviro Tough Liner or ETL. ETL is specially designed to insulate shipping containers from damages caused by temperature spikes and moisture penetration during transportation. This video will give you step-by-step -step instructions for installing the ETL. The procedures depicted here apply to the 20-foot, 40-foot and 40-foot high cube containers. Step 1. Preparation of accessories. Place in a convenient fashion all the necessary accessories. Check to see that you have 5 pieces of lashing, foil tape and optional double-sided adhesive, liner, 5 pieces of lashing. Only 4 pieces of lashing are used, an additional piece of lashing is provided as spare. Place one pair of lashing at each side wall. Begin your installation process by unraveling a lashing. Slip the lashing's buckle under both lashing bars, starting from the top bar. Thread the live end of the lashing through the first lug and follow through to the back of the container. Reduce slack on the lashing and thread it through both lashing bars at the back of the container. Take hold of the next coil of lashing and insert the running end under the lower lashing bar right through to the top lashing bar. Slip this end of the lashing into the buckle of the first lashing and tighten the buckle. With the buckle end of the lashing, thread it through all the lashing points while moving towards the back of the container. Insert the buckle under the lowest lashing bar and work it under the top bar. Locate the earlier running end of the lashing and buckle up. Be sure to reduce any slack on the lashings. Tie slip knots where there are excess lashing. Do the same for the opposite wall. Step 2. Liner Installation Place the liner at the entrance of the container. Begin to unfold the liner from the back of the container and work your way towards the front of the container. Spread out the ETL evenly. Ensure that the white surface of the ETL is placed on the floor panel facing up. Pull the elastic cord found at the top front corner of the ETL. Drag it over and under the top lashing bar. Pull the elastic cord found at the bottom front corner of the ETL. Drag it under the bottom lashing bar. Buckle up and reduce slack. Start attaching the liner's metal hooks onto the lashing. Attach the hooks between each lug. Work your way to the back of the container. Tie the elastic cord found at the top back corners of the ETL to the top lashing bar at the back of the container. Attach the liner's hooks between lashing points. Attach only one hook between each lashing point. Repeat the same steps on the opposite side. Elastic loops are available to secure the ETL. Secure each elastic loop onto a top door cam keeper. Firmly secure to all four top door cam keepers. The remaining four elastic loops at each end of the ETL are to be attached to both top and bottom door headers of the container's door. You are now ready to position the loading platform for the loading process. Step 3. Sealing of liner opening. Begin your loading process. When you have completed loading all your goods into the container, remove the elastic loops from both the top and bottom door headers. Close the flaps of the ETL. Seal this vertical opening with foil adhesive.
Remove the elastic loops hanging overhead from the top door cam keepers. Pull down the ETL flap. Lift the flap from the floor and fold this over the opening. Seal this horizontal opening with foil adhesive tape. This completes the installation process of the Enviro Tough Liner, which applies to 20 foot, 40 foot, and 40 foot high cube containers. Unloading. After opening the container door, remove the horizontally placed adhesive foil from the ETL. Open up the ETL and secure the elastic loops onto the top door cam keepers of the container. Remove the vertically placed foil adhesive tape on the next ETL layer. Unfurl the ETL and hang the elastic loops onto top and bottom door headers. Now the container is ready for unloading. For more information, log on to www.sendmiguelwoven.com. Enviro Tough Liner, your number one choice for container insulation.